All right, so I wanted to put together just a quick video of um, some of the customers that they come in a lot and they ask me, well, hey, what do you carry on a regular basis? I don't have one setup that fits my lifestyle, so I have a blend of what you see here and I'll go over it. Um, so today, I'm going out on a boat, so I'll show you my EDC for today in case I get wet, um, which I'm notorious for falling off the boat. <clears throat> and then I've got my um, office carry. Um, if I'm in the warehouse, I'll carry something a little different. But I think it's fascinating on how everyone else has, you know, their EDC setups. I think it's, you know, it's great to see how individuals incorporate what they use on a day-to-day -day basis and actually how they carry them. Um, mine's pretty simple based on my weight, size, and my clothing. Um, you got to start with all that and what state you're in and what, what credentials you have to carry. My philosophy is if it fits on here, on my tray, I'm going to carry it. So, um, oh, how the watch, watch cut off there. So, quick overview. Um, I'll start with the firearm first. So, it is a custom Zev, um, straight from Zev, um, um, when they were doing uh, the Dragonfly series. Um, Love the gun. It's been reliable, um, but it's a, it's a, you know, Gucci Glock. But then again, um, I've liked it so far. I like all, it fits my hand very well and all the features on it. Um, so today I'll be wearing a Graham Deep Diver. I carry always with me, um, especially if on the boat doing activities, I'll carry a Surefire pin. I always carry a bracelet that I got in south of France. I carry the Surefire light, the Pro. Um, I've liked this light. People have asked me the difference between the two. I'm not going to do a huge review on this one. I just like the body of this one. Um, I do dry, as I mentioned, I fish a lot, and when I've got my kids, we fall in the water. So mm, the, the aluminum body I've really liked. The Pretty much the thing that's going to be consistently the same on my everyday carry is going to be my wallet for now. Um, again, it's been wet a few times, but the only issues I've had with Dango products is the, the bands don't always last, but that's been a great wallet for me um, with my lifestyle. One of the knives I carry, probably shouldn't carry this kind of knife on the boat all the time, but this is a custom um, Tony. It's a, it's a, basically another Microtech, but it's a, a Seagal um, out of the custom shops, out of Tony's custom shop. Love the knife. Um, and this is basically what I'm going to be wearing um, on a regular, this is pretty much what I have majority of the time um, in and out of activities. For, for today's on the boat, I'm going to put this aside, and I carry this. I carry this with all my gear. It's been in the water, been dunked, Glock 43, it's been customized, it's got some upgraded trigger um, sights. Um, I do a lot of shooting suppressed, so I always have threaded barrels in all my, all my products that I carry. Um, so, quickly get this off here real quick. And if I'm in the office, right? So, if you come inside the shop and you want to know what I've got on, um, I've got a custom holster from Nighthawk Custom. Um, I have a T3 stainless that was all uh, done for me, custom and grid. Um, my favorite all-time firearm to carry, shoot. Problem of it is, though, is that um, it does weigh a lot. So, again, everybody's EDC is completely different, which I think is awesome, being able to pick up tricks from others and um, how they're able to accommodate a heavier firearm when they carry. But, you know, you want to be comfortable. This one inside the office, um, don't have a problem whether I wear it outside the belt, but um, usually I have a shirt that goes over this one. And what I'll do is I usually carry the same when I'm with this setup. I'll rock this, and I'll rock a 41 millimeter, not the 40, 41 millimeter, uh, rose gold presidential I got in Monaco. So, love that watch. So, two favorite watches. These are my go-to every single day. Um, and then, when I'm inside the office, I'll wear, or I'll rock one of the Mont Blancs. When I'm out running around, I'll carry the smaller one. So, if you see me on the gun range, um, again, I'll be carrying... Um, Usually my Zev, but I will take maybe a different knife just because I'm doing different things on the range. I'm cutting a lot of different items, cut a lot of rope. <clears throat> I also um, carry this as well. Um, it hasn't really held up as well as it should, but then again, you know, the, the knife is relatively inexpensive compared to, you know, a, a couple thousand bucks I think these things go for. <clears throat> but... The knife, some people also don't like the double safety. I don't mind it. Um, I think with my Glock 19X, um, if I'm, you know, on the range doing a demo, I put this in my vest um, or my chest rig, and it's worked out well. Let's see, what else I got here? So that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I, you know, um, hit us up, info at gunsnfa. Um, 
you know, again, we uh, this is just what I this is what I wear on a regular basis. So my motto is, if it fits on this tray, um, it's going to be on me, and then I just kind of piece it up. But I always have one of each, and pretty much like I said, I guess the consistency would be these are my two most consistent items I carry no matter what. So, anyways, got any questions, man? Um, hope this. Uh, uh, you guys can share and like, but I like seeing uh, other people's everyday carry and see what they do.